with the advent and proliferation of social media and everybody and them grandmother having a smartphone we're seeing where access to celebrities is now at the fingertips of millions and as such consequently these celebrities um expose bits and pieces of their personal lives to their adoring fans we're seeing where situations would have arisen in the not so distant past where jamaican um, celebrities whether it be sports stars or recording artists would have come under fire for the choice they would have made in selecting a girlfriend we saw where asafa powell got it we saw where popcorn got it and we see you now where egyptian is getting it egyptian comes under fire after photos surfaces with his new girlfriend <laughs> may i chat about it my soul circle Fans are blasting recording artist Egyptian after photos surfaced with his longtime girlfriend. Social media users quickly labeled the older pit maker as a sellout after discovering he was dating a Caucasian woman. According to some users, Egyptian has joined the growing list of dancehall reggae artists selling out the Jamaican women for foreigners. Sources close to the former VP records artist says he does not care about what the haters have to say because he's truly happy and in love. <laughs> I could be real about this. The man free fit love and they with who him want they with. The man is a big man and the man free for make him own choice. You understand? I understand so some of the Jamaican ladies them I go feel like say yo the man they must sell out and uh, not interested in them no more and you yeah, understand what I say? And it, it probably look like that. But what you know, I see some people are raise some valid points. You yeah, understand what I say? I see a lady, I say, yo, if a Jamaican woman them now, they more interested in the man them instead of what the man them have or what the man them can offer them, then the thing would be different. Listen to this. Maybe if a Jamaican girl them never just interested in what the man has and what they can get while only offering sex, nobody would be selling them out. Some of them, you can't even talk to. You understand? That person named Sanjay Gunter. See, I don't know if it's a man or it's a woman still. You see me? But it's a valid point. You understand? It's a point where you can't ignore. You understand? I know some people are cuss the post there. And I'll cuss me to one name sickness still. But the fact of the matter is that some Jamaican girls. No substance to the thing. You can't, as that as a post here, say, can't even hold a decent conversation with. There's no level or skills of communication. Them not bring nothing to the table. You understand me? I say, them, them probably have a pretty face, them shape nice, them skin clean. You know, them ask a cup like care when they jack up. <laughs> but the truth of the matter is peace. When you come on to bring in substance to a relationship, many of them not have that. You understand? Many Jamaican ladies, on the flip side, however, possesses all the requisite skills and uh, necessities to um, foster or sustain a committed relationship. Many of them are educated. Many of them are independent. But at the end of the day, a man like who I'm like. You understand? And a man when I travel the world, I perform and probably live outside of Jamaica. I go interact with females from different races, from different um, background. And more than likely, a female I go tickle him fancy. You understand me? I say. So the man decides to add a choice they want to make. Who, who am I or who is you for that matter for you criticize what the man find love you understand <laughs> so the people who must say the man are sell out still me I pray say you know have to look on the thing differently too you understand me I say love no no color love no no race you understand me I say love is just love anyway fine it fine at death so it there you see me the pun so we can't we can't to, to complain about the thing you see me, if, if Bob Marley and Cindy never link up, gang on a band. You see me, Tabo. If, 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 um, Sedela Buka, which is Bob Marley's mother, and the white brother never link up, what one of the greatest record artists in our history? You see me, Tabo, peeps. So love is love. You see me, I say, we can't fight it. You see, you have to just embrace it when it, when, 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 when it touch it. 
You see me I say? So I just one of them things. So I don't think it's a big deal. See, I don't know much about the girl. I don't know her name. I try to do some research, but I don't find out nothing. I don't know her name. I don't know where she heal from. You understand? I don't know how they link me. I just know say. I come across an article where say Egyptian find a new girl and people are friends and I decide to so look into it. <laughs> so at that, that time I know peace. The catty boy basically and you know the word that they use is Caucasian. And the boss has said no business about he, she, and the old lady, I'm happy and I'm in love. So at the end of the day, if you don't feed him and you don't clothe him, then you don't make no sense. You say nothing. No, that the man has said, it's a face to your brain. No? <laughs> Remember one year I got a sting on them about the dog and the dog has said, yo, make sure it's a run of a plaza to not give me, you know, because I don't perform my big song. It's a dog, no business. <laughs> so, Egyptian daddy. <coughs> Go and do your thing. If I see you find love, brother, and if you're happy, as I say, and if she complete you and make you happy, then angry your business, papa, manners and respect, and mama, take care of general still. You see me the pan. Ladies, I do so you think, you understand? My God. Thank you for watching the video. Drop a like and a comment down below and consider subscribing if you haven't done so as yet. Until next time, walk good.